Hey chickies, welcome back to Vlogtober Day 29. Today I thought I would share a really quick Trader Joe's haul. I really wanted to venture out and try different things and we'll most likely update you guys in future Sunday faves and days. So if you're new here, I'm Christine. I'm currently participating in Vlogtober. I'm uploading a video every single day for the month of October. I would greatly appreciate it if you please subscribe to my channel. I would absolutely love it if you'd be a part of the Chicky crew. Also hit that bell to be notified of new videos. These two are pretty much a staple right now in our house because we really, really love these. Go to the classic potato chips. Now the reason why we like these is because they're very light, they're not heavy. Even though they are potato chips, you don't feel so guilty and you don't feel super, I guess, heavy after eating them because they are very, very light, light chips. Ghost pepper potato chips. I've never tried these and I love spicy food, so you know what, let's actually try them. I mean, you can definitely smell that there's some spice, but it's not that bad. Here's the chip itself. Oh, these are good. And I love that little kick of spice. This reminds me of the Miss Vicky's jalapeno potato chips. Mmm, okay. Those mini marshmallows, these are supposed to be gluten-free and also vegan. I thought this would be great just to kind of maybe put a few of them in my black coffee if I'm not having any creamer. A bundle of the organic medley of potatoes just to kind of incorporate into some of our meals. Really great side dish. Four chocolate croissants. Just proof, let rise overnight and bake. And as I was um, actually grabbing a box of this, a lady was kind enough to tell me that these are absolutely delicious. She grabbed two boxes and I was like, okay, you know, I'm sold. My husband loves chocolate croissant, so I thought this would be a good one. Trader Joe's mini vegetable samosas. Have you guys tried any of these items that I'm mentioning right now? If you have, please leave some feedback. My mom really loves samosas, so I really wanted to give this one a go. I was very intrigued when I saw this. It's the butternut squash pizza crust. You guys know how much I love cauliflower pizza crust, so I thought I'd give this a go. It's made with butternut squash, corn flour, olive oil, and a touch of salt. So, of course you still have to put your own toppings on it, but I was just curious on the taste if this was, you know, a good alternative if I kind of get sick of uh, cauliflower crust pizza. Let's try out the Trader Joe's pumpkin spice seasoning, which I think will pair deliciously with the marshmallows. Cup of black coffee, small handful of the marshmallows, and then sprinkle some of the pumpkin spice. Pumpkin pie spice over top for just like a little kick if you don't want creamer or you could also add creamer but I just thought that would be an interesting mix and you know just a nice little treat in the morning then I also saw the mushroom and company it's a multi-purpose umami seasoning blend it's supposed to be like a savory taste and you can basically sprinkle it over everything I was about to get the everything but the bagel seasoning and I decided you know what let's step out of our comfort zone and get this one instead speaking of trying other things ended up getting some alcohol, which is uh, also something different for me. This is the uh, Simpler brand wines. It's the Peach Italian Wine Cocktail. There are four cans in here. I thought this would be great to kind of drink on um, Halloween just for kicks while uh, passing out candy if anybody even doorbells this year. So let me know if you guys have tried any of the food items that I mentioned in today's video. And uh, what are you guys curious about and what are you thinking about picking up next time you go to Trader Joe's? Or if you have any suggestions on items I should try out. So I hope you enjoyed today's Trader Joe's haul. If you did, please make sure you give this video a like, subscribe if you have not already. I would love for you to be a part of the Chicky crew. Make sure you come back tomorrow for Vlogtober Day 30. Thank you Chicky so much for watching. Have an amazing day and I will see you tomorrow for a brand new video. Mwah.